Hey everybody, if you like this video, please subscribe, but I'm going to really take a quick look at uh, Timeline and uh, how to uh, make simple movies inside ZBrush for release 4. Okay, so this is a scene I've been working on that um, is a pretty fancy alien head and uh, I was just going to try and animate this character uh, I've opened up timeline but let's unhide this and okay go to movies movie and then open up timeline and then click show okay that gives you your animation bar and right now we can uh, scroll across and nothing's animated because we haven't put anything yet and this is the real cool thing that I'm really excited to dive into. Right now, it's uh, it's only going to focus on the camera movements, so we can do anything else, and it will not be affected um, besides the camera movements. Really, really cool. So let's look at that really quickly. Movie. Okay, yeah. Timeline tracker or tracks. Uh, look at all this. Camera, color, material, wireframes, transparent. Well, um, subtooled, Z spheres, sub subdivide, lots of cool stuff that I'm really excited to get into. So, anyway, it's on camera movement. So all you need to need to do is uh, get your initial frame. So move around wherever you want to be, or wherever you want to start, and then click on the uh, timeline, and then click, you know, somewhere over here and move your guy and click again to accept that change and then keep moving right okay that that's nice and then keep moving and yeah okay so let's see what that did click up here right isn't that cool fancy Nice. I'm like I said, I'm still diving into this, but this is a great, great feature that I'm going to explore very, very heavily, and could possibly make you know 30 or 40 videos just on timeline or more, depending on how deep I dive into it. So I'm I'm really excited, and uh, yeah. So stay tuned. 